My name is Beth McCormick. Um, I am a professor and vice chair of the Department of Microbiology and Physiological Systems. And the work that I do in my lab centers around host pathogen interactions and the mechanisms by which they induce uh, mucosal inflammation. I do spend a lot of time in the lab and I'm known for my very long hours in, in lack of sleep. You can't be one dimensional and so yes, I, I do have a couple of hobbies. One of them is playing music and uh, performing in a band where I'm a drummer. And that provides a, a, nice, a nice outlet. The band experience actually started very organically. Uh, I, I was at a, a fast sub-summer gastrointestinal uh, meeting. At these meetings, generally the last evening, there's this banquet and they typically have band or a DJ in this particular since they had a band come in. And, uh, you know, there was known that a few of us in, you know, of the attendees of this meeting knew how to play instruments. And so during one of their set breaks, the band caught wind of this uh, and asked a few of us to come up on stage and start to play together. Uh, so we were actually caught by surprise by this. Um, but when we came together, it was just very seamless and we performed for about 45 minutes. Since it was a GI based meeting um, and you know we were a little bit unrefined at that time and uh, the one of the, the players of the band said that it was giving him GI distress <laughs> listening to us perform and so we thought ah that's a great name for the band. We started off playing more classic rock and you know um, but we tried to kind of put a little punk rock edge to it. The new that we're I think there's a lot of parallels uh, between music and, this, and the science that we do. In both venues, it's, just, it's a, a foundation and baseline of communication. You are, in a way, entertaining the audience and trying to engage the audience in, in some fashion. There's this you know, thread of commitment and dedication to both music as, as well as in science.